None of Colorado's 14ers got Plutoed. Remember when we did that to the former planet, kicked it out of a club we always thought it had been in? No, all of Colorado's 14,000 foot peaks have passed their inspection and they're still 14,000 foot peaks. Researchers with the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, NOAA, spent years remapping the height of everything in the state. It's a new measuring system being rolled out nationwide by 2026 that'll use measures of gravity to correct current GPS measurements. In mountainous terrain, that correction could change the official elevation by feet. Scientists tested the new measuring system on Colorado's 14ers, and they say a couple of them dropped by nearly five measured feet. That kind of haircut could have knocked Sunshine Peak in the San Juans off the list of 14ers altogether, but Sunshine scraped by. And now Huron Peak takes the bottom spot as the shortest 14er. And it turns out that not only is Sunshine safe, it's no longer the lowest. It's actually Huron Peak is now just by a few inches lower than Sunshine, but it's still, again, I think uh, something like five feet above the threshold. So really nothing was in danger, it turns out, of uh, dropping below 14, which honestly makes me really happy. Researchers say these new measurements will be especially helpful in flat areas because there, measuring slight changes in elevation will make it easier to predict the flow of water. That'll have a big impact on everything from floodplain management to irrigation to construction.